Yeah. You need to scoot over. You're not in oh, your God. spot. I wasn't getting there because I wasn't all the way ready. <laughs> oh, Georgia! Wait, do I not do it? Hello, everybody. My name is Georgia. If you are new here today, I have something super awesome planned for you guys and us. I have with me our resident vegan, kind of, my cousin, Skylar. I'm Skylar. <laughs> I went to Whole Foods earlier and got a whole bunch of vegan snacks that I think we would enjoy. We have this bag of food. First one, we have sweet potato fries. <laughs> Next one is Maker's um, granola minis, chocolate chip pouches, and mixed berry pouches. Oh, they're like on the go. It's like little granola balls. Little <laughs> packs of them. <laughs> God. <laughs> I realized my co anchor just said that for them. Unreal. Dark chocolate coconut minis. And I know that my co anchor has had this before, so. And the granola thing. And the granola things. Jeez, I get it. Ooh, I'm really excited about these. Have you ever had pupusas? You don't like those? You don't? <laughs> They're like too dry. How did you cook them? Probably in the microwave or the toaster, and I don't know. Seems like it needs to be in a stove top. Well, I know that's not how I did it. Maybe that's it. <laughs> I think I'm gonna try them anyways. I mean, I'll try them too. I mean, so yeah. That's the whole. That's what we're doing here. Okay, anyways. These are zucchini muffins. Oh wait, I didn't even show you this. My bed, that's my bed. Got some drinks. Mm -hmm. Chameleon organic cold brew. Non-dairy. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were in the theater. Okay, wait. Who that? Back in there for some- <laughs> I'm hungry. I'm hungry. <laughs> Chameleon organic cold brew. Oat milk latte, USDA organic with organic oat milk. <laughs> Why did you eat so much? <laughs> Just, it's not, you can't even see it. Look, you guys, look. Cold brew. Read it and weep. Next. Sweet potato puffs. Vegan cheesy cheddar. They're like Cheetos. Oh, vegan Cheetos. No, yeah, well, I don't know if I have. I've always wanted to try vegan marshmallows. <laughs> have you already tried them? Um, not those ones. Not these, not this brand. I'm pretty sure I've had that brand, but not the big ones. Georgia, I honestly don't know. A hundred percent vegan. Goodbye, your life. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're so good at reading them. Ben and Jerry's vegan chocolate chip cookie dough chunks. Snackable dough. Next! Oh god, that was disgusting. Right? I'm so excited. <laughs> Mini crab cakes, but without the A. So it's curb. It's curb cakes. Yummy. This one. Vegan jerky, y'all. Vegan meal. jerky. Excitement. Next! You, uh Something I've been wanting to get. Vegan ease. It's so versatile. Another drink. It is London Fog Nitro Oat Milk Earl Grey Tea. Oh, I totally forgot to mention that this is my new couch. That's gonna go with my new house. Basically, this couch is a legless, like, movable couch like I know all couches are movable but this one like look the back lifts up and goes back and then you have all this space to like lay down watch she be vegan oh wait there's more wait what in hand oh no another one is in and that's it you guys I totally forgot there is something in the oven we put these in there 
I'm so excited for cinnamon rolls. I made cinnamon rolls from scratch like a few weeks ago and they didn't turn out the greatest. So I'm excited to, to try some good cinnamon rolls. Hopefully they're good. wasn't expecting that question. <laughs> what do you mean? There's <laughs> something that you looked at and you were like, wow, I have to have that in my mouth right now. Honestly, no. There was stuff I was like, wow, I wish I wasn't going to put that in my mouth right now. I have faith in the vegan community making everything taste good. Me too. Except maybe not the bacon. Yeah. Or the ham. Or the ham. <laughs> or the crab things. Ooh, you know what? I'm most excited for the cinnamon rolls. <laughs> we're going to try the... Zucchini muffins first. We have a list of questions. Oh, I have a question for you actually. That, that I wanted to um, kickstart the conversation. I thought it would be fun to talk about our origin story. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, gosh, gosh. Clink. It tastes kind of like carrot cake, but not. There are little flakes of zucchini in here. It's really sweet, actually. Like, it's not. What does zucchini taste like? Vegetable-y? Yeah, it's not vegetable-y. Tell me, how did you become a vegan? It all started when my mom visited an animal farming place, like a factory, <laughs> when she was in school and <laughs> on a field trip. And she saw how the animals died. Why are you laughing? <laughs> and she went vegetarian. What is going on right now? What is going on now? Okay. And I always wanted to be a vegetarian growing up because she was a vegetarian. And then first day of high school, 2014, I was like, I'm a high schooler now. I can go vegan. And I wrote a six-page essay and I gave it to my dad on why I was going vegan. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> okay, do you want a muffin? George is over here eating all of them. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Our grandmother is trying one now. We're mm -hmm. going to describe her face for you. You have to face us. Okay. Okay. Mm. It's okay. <laughs> What's your origin story? First, we're going to try another snack. What do you want to try next? The cinnamon rolls. Oh, they're hot. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we have cinnamon, the Annie cinnamon rolls that I showed you earlier. <gasps> Oh my god! <laughs> of course, of course. She just dropped the cinnamon roll upside down. It was upside on the plate. down on the plate, but of course she would do that. <laughs> Maybe you should use the fork. No, it's okay. I got this. Mm, splendid. My origin story. I was originally a vegetarian. What year was it? 2014? 2014. It was like November that you went to vegetarian. It was deer hunting season. My dad and my brother went out, <laughs> shot a deer, brought it back, showed me its head, showed me its heart. Ew. Or was it a brain? I don't remember. I kind of blocked off that day. Anyways, it was gross. And by that time, Skylar was already vegan, so I was like, if she can do it, I can do it. I was vegetarian first. <laughs> I told you we needed napkins. And um, that's exactly what I told my parents. And then they laughed at me. Everyone didn't think she could do it. Mm -hmm. I have been vegetarian from November 2014. Since then, I have tried meat here and there and haven't changed my ways. So. I can't believe I'm eating this whole cinnamon roll. What the heck? We have so <laughs> much food to eat. What the heck? Okay, what do you want to try next? We should try something savory because that was really sweet. We could do the cheese puff things. Half of steam. That's literally more than half air. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> There's almost like a little sour tinge. Yeah, kind of like bad cheese. What's the most annoying thing about me? I don't know. Yeah. You're kind of a know it all sometimes. But that's not the most annoying thing. It's just 
Are we both answering? Yeah. Ben, so you're answering? I'm asking. I didn't know that I was going to be criticized today, so I'd rather <laughs> not. Actually, please pick another question. Oh, you know what? We should try our drinks. Oh, wait, did you? Oh, this is really good. Oh, wow. I have the London Fog one. I have the oat milk latte. Oh. Do not like. Got it. You don't like yours. <laughs> I like mine. Let's see. Kind of like it. Yours tastes almost flowery. Which one do you like more? Yours. You guys, I used to eat papooses all the time before I was vegan. Sadly, it is hard to find some without any cheese. You know what? While this is cooking, we can try another stuff. That's called multitasking. Come on. Okay. All right, so while that is cooking, we are going to try a chocolate chip cookie dough chalk snackable dough keep frozen Ben and Jerry vegan. <laughs> there are a lot of words on this on the packaging. Do they expect me to read all those? All I see is vegan and I pick it up. Would you rather live with no internet or no AC or heating? <laughs> where am I living? I would assume where you live now. Where can I move? <laughs> Please. I have more questions. Wait, are we not answering that question? I'm focused on the cookie dough. You can't expect me to do two things, three things at once. <laughs> oh gosh, my papooch. I choose internet. No it's internet? too hot where we live. Without AC, I would die. So how does it mean? How would I teach classes if I didn't have any internet? But does it mean just like your Wi-Fi or like your actual like service? Oh, don't ask any more questions. <laughs> it's just the question. Answer the question. <laughs> Whatever, that question is stupid. Let's do another one. What does your name mean and why was it given to you? Mm. I was named after my great grandfather. What were you named after? I don't know. Mm. KK, why why was I given my name? I think you might have just thought it was very pretty. They almost named me Chloe Ashlyn and I'm glad they didn't. Yeah. It's my friend. Clink. It's not the greatest. Um, the consistency is pretty terrible. It's kind of overwhelmingly pickly, but then it also has a weird spiciness. It's really, really salty. What is one of your favorite memories? I have so many. Okay, I just picked one. I said one of your favorites. Yeah, that's what I just said. I have so many. How can I just... <laughs> oh, oh, I have one. When I went on the Arkansas trip, Christian Rick. You know what? We didn't have internet out there. Oh. So that answers that AC <laughs> question. Boom. And you can watch it. It's on my YouTube channel. Okay, you know what? One of my all time favorite <laughs> is the chocolate milk. <laughs> my grandmother's son's first child's best friend's uncle had a cousin. <laughs> And that cousin and I were, we were sleeping over together and we were in the computer room watching Bridge the Terra on my grandmother's computer and we had these little cups from Chuck E. Cheese and they had like the swirly red straw and so we went and got chocolate milk and then we went back in and we were drinking our chocolate milk and something happened, I don't know if I said something or what, but my uncle's brother's sister's daughter's cousin or whatever whatever whoever they were i don't remember they they were drinking the chocolate milk when the funny thing happened oh my gosh i forgot all i forgot the whole story so they started to joke and spit their chocolate milk out all over my grandmother's computer and it came out their nose and, but they survived i hope they're okay i i know they're okay a little psychologically damaged but Okay, nonetheless. Probably because the per only other person that was there keeps bringing it up. <laughs> Alright, let's give this a whirl. Oh wait, there's two different yeah, flavors. Yeah. Get out of here. Clink. Ow! <laughs> I don't like it. I like mine. I don't try yours. I'm gonna try yours. Clink. 
I already bought them better. Yeah, my experience is better. Oh. I'm stuck in the uh, clink! <laughs> we got it! Those are good. You win a trip and you're allowed to bring two people. Who do you pick? I have, wait, what? What's the first one? <laughs> Priscilla. Oh my gosh, this is hard. Probably Kenley. Priscilla and Kenley. Oh my gosh, that'd be so fun. Oh my gosh, I'm actually a trip with this. That sounds like so much fun. You guys, we should go on a trip together. I know who I wouldn't pick. Oh. I don't know, it's a where I'm going. I agree. I guess I'd pick Anthony and Aaron. All right, finally, the pupusa is done. This is what it looks like. Wait, I'll just cut this. <laughs> you did such a bad job cutting it. I thought I was just cutting a little part. I was too. Well, I did a better job, because look, you're still over there cutting stuff. Why not? <laughs> Wait, we didn't get to click it. Click it. It looks really hot, actually. I'm not looking. <laughs> your parents meet oh my god i actually don't remember how your parents met i think they met um my dad has this childhood friend named jamie He's married <laughs> to a girl named jamie who is who happens to befriend my mother and then everyone ended up meeting and then <laughs> i guess that's how that happened i don't know i wasn't there and you me i'm pretty sure my parents met when they were teenagers in rehab. I'm getting kind of full. Cool. Wanna make that sandwich now? Okay, we are making the things to make a sandwich. Wait, it actually smells kind of good. Like, almost kind of like real food. <laughs> Honestly, it kind of smells like a dog treat. Did you also put the yum on there? So while the bacon is cooking, let's get another question. When was the last time you cried? <laughs> I cry all the time. <laughs> I cry in my car, I cry before I go to sleep, I cry before I go to work, I cry after work, oh my god, I cry in the shower. <laughs> I cry when I'm reading, I cry when I'm watching cute baby videos, cute dog videos. <laughs> Can you use when you cry? Oh no. I am so just gonna miss you. <laughs> Um, probably a snake. You know, I have so many pictures <laughs> of you eating like that. It's just easier to let it fall down. Why do I have to explain myself to you? What do you eat like? You know, I've been compared to a bunny or a mouse. What's one useless skill you'd love to learn? I really want to learn how to unicycle. I knew you were going to say that. Really? Yeah. I really want to know how to unicycle. I really want to know how to juggle and unicycle at the same time. I feel like no skill is actually useless because there can be a way to either make monetary gains or it's not useless if you enjoy it because you're getting happiness. Ru Rubik's cubes. Yeah, that's actually really cool. But like ones that aren't just the... Four by three by three? Yeah, because I can do the three by three. Ah! This looks so awful. Like a little ham and cheese bacon mayo sandwich. You put two cheesies on there. Mm -hmm. Extra cheesy. You should have cut it like a triangle. Oh, dang. It's pretty weird looking. Great. There's something so off about this sandwich, but I do not know what. It's like everything has the flavor of the thing that it's supposed to be, but it's so off. I don't even know how to explain it. It tastes everything individually. 
That does not taste like ham. This does taste like provolone. This bacon isn't awful. This is really gross to me. There's worse vegan bacon. That does not taste like mayonnaise, but it, like, I'm not mad at it. No, I feel like you can definitely taste the avocado. I feel like you can too. An odd combination. Now we are going to try the vegan crab cakes. This is what they look like. It's really squishy and kind of weird. All those are cooking on the stove top. We are going to try marshmallows. Yay! I have been wanting to try these marshmallows for a while, you guys. Thank you. I haven't had a marshmallow since since I became a vegetarian. What's the best present you've ever received? Uh, maybe my laptop, my car. What about you? My camera. That's what it looks like. Oh, my stomach feels huge. Oh my gosh. Clink. I don't like it. It doesn't taste like crab at all. It super doesn't. And also it's not good. Tell me something positive that has happened in your life recently. My lawyer uh -huh. for the divorce case okay. and child custody. Um, Brett also has a lawyer and I got a new lawyer and Brett now has a new lawyer because both of our lawyers left their firms and they settled on a mediator when so this has been going on for like two years now. So we're moving forward. Oh, okay. That is good. Yeah, what about you? First, we are going to try this dark chocolate coconut bar, which is finally the last thing. Thank goodness, because my stomach is about to explode. Clink. I've had these before. I like them. And dark chocolate's so good for you, like for your heart and whatever. Oh, something good that's happening in my life right now. I start a new job tomorrow. Woohoo! Woohoo! Mom. It's gonna be at a daycare. Finally, gonna be working with kids, which is awesome. So, what do you think? What was your favorite thing that we tried? The hot fries. Hot fries were pretty good. What was yours? Probably the pupusas. That was good. Yeah. See, I told you it was good. You might have noticed that I am in a different kitchen than normal. I'm staying with my grandmother for the summer. We are in Houston, and I have plenty of more ideas for you guys, for, for us to do together as family. All right, we have to split stuff up. What do you want? You can take all the sandwich stuff. <laughs> if you have any suggestions of any videos that you would like to see me or us in in future videos let us know leave a comment below and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button <laughs> oh thank you very much and if you missed it this is my cousin for life i will just see you in the next video thank you so much for watching and i'm so glad y'all were here with us today bye, bye. see you next time